Hey guys, welcome back to another video tutorial. It, this is the last tutorial for the color grading section. In this lesson, we are going to learn how to apply cinematic color presets to your film. If you guys are editing with me, you should have this kind of uh, situation right now with the first few clips sorted at the beginning, the Sony clips and then GoPro clips uh, together with uh, a couple of clips from the drone within a compound clip so within this little folder if we go in by double clicking we'll see all of our single clips so let's just go out by clicking on this little arrow you just go back and because you want to apply one color preset to all of our film we could select all of our clips like that and then right click and create another compound clip which will incorporate these clips here as well as these are the compound clip so let's select them all and then right click here new compound clip just okay and then oh boom magic see what happens so we'll have another compound clip which includes double clicking we'll get access to what we had before so our bunch of clips, Sony clips here, and then the other compound clip, which includes, if we go in, the GoPro clips together with drones. So go back at the beginning, and we want to apply LUTs. Well, LUTs are basically color filters, as I mentioned before. We also, on our website, projectgo.pro, we offer filters optimized specifically for GoPro footage. I have included three color presets with this video course, which come from the whole package that is on the site. So how do we apply a custom LUT? As you have seen here, I have created a compound clip, which is very useful because now we just have to work on one selection and not on every single clip. So then let's go over the effect tab here and then in the research bar we need to find LUT so type in LUT L -U -T. if you're using the latest Final Cut Pro version then you should have custom LUT which is an effect by Final Cut Pro if you're using an older Final Cut Pro editor version then you won't have custom LUT but you can download some third-party LUT loader like Pixel Film Studios for example and then you can you can just read the instruction over there how to apply LUTs with third-party loaders but in this video we're gonna focus on uh, custom LUT so the effect that Final Cut has incorporated in the last update so if we want to apply a LUT we can just search for LUT within the effects find this one drop it on our compound clip then head over the inspector and we'll see that under effects we have custom LUT. Make sure that this is checked and then you just need to select your LUTs from this drop down menu. Click here and then choose custom LUT. Locate your LUT package and then once you open it, you should have a folder which is called LUTs by Project GoPro Cube and then select one of the three LUTs that I have included with this video course. In here I have the whole package that is for sale on our website. So I'm just gonna use Cine Travel. The Cine Travel filter LUT will give you footage, a cinematic touch, as you can see by skipping the video. So the colors have gained power and contrast, as you see. The blue looks mo way more blue, and also the oranges have been highlighted. This particular preset is similar to orange and teal which is perfect for travel from here from this bar you can adjust the power of it so how much of the LUT you want to apply so weaker and stronger I would suggest you not to keep the maximum amount but lower it down a little bit to about 0.6 that's a good amount Once you load the LUT on your film, it will totally change the style, the mood and the feel of it. 